Hey guys, it's me Jewel. I am back with a new video. Obviously today I will be doing my heatless curls, which I love. I always do this all the time. Um, basically I'll be showing you how to do these heatless curls and yeah, just keep watching and I hope you guys stay tuned to the end. Let's say. Bye. Guys, the things you will need for this hair tutorial are knee-high socks, any knee-high socks will do, hair ties, hairspray, and also I'm using a curling cream by Pantene, but you guys can use water or none at all, it does not matter whatsoever. Okay guys, the first step to do is obviously brush your hair, and as you can see, I was having a horrible time brushing my hair as it had lots of tangles, and yep, that's about it, and here's me having a moment, yeah, looking great, Joel, thanks, yeah. Guys, the next step is to part your hair. Now, as you can see that I'm parting my hair in the middle. That's only because I usually part my hair in the middle anyways. But you guys can part your hair however you want it to be. Because, you, you know, you, you do you, girl. You do you. Okay, guys, I totally forgot to mention that you need these big clips. That's only because I have thick hair to separate my hair. Now, first of all, you're going to need to separate your hair into two sides, and then you'll be splitting that into half. And as you can see, I'm doing it right now. And I basically clip my hair into a little bun so it holds shape and no hair gets, like, caught. guys the next step is to use curling cream I'm using the one by Pantene as I said early on you guys can use water or none at all it is totally up to your preference okay guys the next step is you're gonna take your knee-high socks and bite them I know it looks really weird but guys trust me on this one and what you're gonna do is split your hair in half again and what you're gonna do with that section of hair is basically wrap your hair around the sock as if it's your curling wand and this is gonna make your hair look spirally and make it look like you actually use a curling wand which we all know you didn't okay guys by the time you reach the point there's no more hair to wrap you're basically gonna do a switcheroo and you're actually gonna do the same thing as you did in the first section but at the end, when you have no more hair, you're basically going to combine the two together and wrap it around with a hair tie. Guys, if you did not understand me trying to explain it in the last time, I hope you guys will understand it if I just leave you to it and see how it goes if you just watch me. Okay guys, when everything is done, basically what you're going to do is go to sleep and let the magic do its job. Okay, here's the day after I did the curls. So what I'm basically doing is unraveling the curls from the sock and you can just see the results straight away as you can see. guys once you're done with unraveling your hair from the sock you're gonna look like a poodle so what you're gonna need is some hairspray and spray that on your hair obviously that's what hairspray is for and what you're gonna do is shake your hair and this is gonna make it look less intense and make it look like you know it's natural ish and cute and beautiful and perfecto Okay guys, this is basically the end. This is the final product, I guess. And I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. Please subscribe down there. I'm going to be making videos once a week, every Sunday. So please stay tuned for that. And give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and it helped you so much. Um, you guys have any questions, please leave it down there. Stay tuned after this because I'll be showing all the bloopers. And yeah.
Adiós. I'm going to be making new videos every Sunday now, once a week. I'm going to be making videos once a week, every Sunday. So please stay tuned. So please. Hair <laughs> yeah, that is kind of long, so I'm just going to like shoot from here.